Good morning, W. Ross. Today is Monday, April 23rd, 2018. Uh, just a little reminder that all Braille classes are canceled for today. Also, it's National Cherry Cheesecake Day. And up next, we've got sports. Here's your daily sports recap from senior residents with your hosts, Lefty Lisk, Scoop Reed, Hometown Harris, and veteran reporter, Microphone Brules. Good morning, sports fans. This is Microphone Brules with your morning sports report. There is goalball action in the Autodrome tonight as the championship game of the Elite Girls Goalball League gets underway at 7.30. After a long and tough two-month regular season, all comes down to one game showdown between the Red Roses and the Purple Sapphires, with the winning team getting their names on the Annette Elizabeth Carmen Cup. Earlier this morning, I talked to the Elite Women's Goalball Commissioner, Ms. Harris, and she told me that she had no doubt that the Roses and Sapphires were the two best teams in this year's inaugural season. There were no upsets in the semifinals, and this is truly a case of the two best teams playing each other in a championship game. In the men's division, the final game of the regular season will be played tonight when the K-Town Crushers take on the Time Travelers. The semifinals of the men's AAA League will take place next Monday, and the championship game is set for next Wednesday. The season-ending pizza party for both the men's and women's league will take place in the Soon Center at the championship men's game next Wednesday. One final note here, we have a special guest today, Rocket Romer. How was your weekend? Good. Did you get out and about and enjoy the weather and get a little active? Yeah. Okay, is there anybody you'd like to do a shout-out for today? Anna. Pardon me? Anna. That's Anna. Oh, have a nice day, Anna. And one further note, go Leafs, go. That's it for sports. I'm Microphone Brules. No, I'm in here. We're out of here. Everyone have a great day. And looking at your weather for Brantford today, it looks like we'll reach a high of 19 degrees outside. It'll be mainly sunny. Yes, if you didn't hear me correctly, I said 19 degrees. Winds at 20 kilometers an hour, gusting up to 40 from the southwest. So it looks like a beautiful day to get outside and enjoy this weather. Tonight we'll go down to a low of plus 6, increasing cloudiness overnight. And winds still from the southeast, just at 20 kilometers an hour. Currently, it's already 7 degrees outside. The wind's at 10 kilometers an hour from the east-northeast. Looking outside here from the studio at W. Ross for the announcements, it's pretty clear, sunny skies, a few clouds here and there, but it looks like it's going to be a great day and a warm week for a long weekend as well. So that's it for your weather and announcements today. Everyone, have a great day.